Real women murders, not fiction. Love women, don't kill them. Giving real women, unknown women, recognition to the world. Please support our channel and please, please subscribe. woman who was shot was not, was approximately eight, seven to eight months pregnant at the time of the incident. She and her unborn child didn't make it. Uh, police say Ayaria Anderson was driving on industrial drive on the on-ramp heading northbound on I-220 when she was struck by a stray bullet Saturday night. Police say Anderson was leaving a Jackson restaurant known as Soups. That's restaurants on Country Club Road. Police found her in her black Nissan Altima on that on ramp. She was taken to the hospital where an emergency C section was performed, but the baby didn't make it. It's so sad. It's unfortunate that this young lady lost her life. You know, she was, she was an in, innocent victim. Um, but, you know, we have to do everything we can, you know, as, as the local government to try to help JPD staff, retain, recruit, raise salaries, and keep them safe and, and, and try to get as many police officers as we can on the ground. Um, but cameras would be a, a big deterrent. Now, Jackson Police Chief Joseph Wade said to 16 WAPT in a statement, it was a very, very sad and unfortunate situation, and we are going to do our due diligence to find out who is accountable and who we are going to arrest in this matter. Now, Jackson Police are asking for your help. If you see something, saw anything, or hear anything about this case, to call Jackson Police. Tonight, we're live outside of JPD headquarters. Michaela Franklin, 16 WAPT News. Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe.